How's it going everybody? Today we are going over the high dive close. Now this is one of my personal favorite closes. It's something that you use after you've already made the presentation, you've gone through the sale, and you're ready to make the close. Um, it's a great way to illustrate and demonstrate why they need to make the decision, and this is when they're coming with the rebuttal of, well, I need to think about it. So let's go ahead and dive in. So um, what is a high dive close? The close is used when someone says they need to think about it, and they're not uh, buying the product. So you've already done the presentation, and they are, for whatever reason, telling you that they need to think about it. And so we're going to create a little urgency and pressure with this. So um, the goal here is to illustrate and demonstrate to the customer why they need to make the decision now to get started on their fitness program. We want to get it started here. Remember, we're not selling tangible, um, like an iPhone or you know a TV or something that they have in their hands. This is very emotional purchase um, because it's something that they're going to get over time and um, they're basically whether they buy it or not walking out empty-handed so we really want to create that urgency and um, use the mind to help them make that buying decision so the first step is we're going to create a, a simple illustration of the decision making process so we're going to kind of lead them through they said they want to think about it so we're going to help them think about it, but we're going to do it while we're here in the gym or you know over the internet, however you present personal training, if you're an online personal trainer or you're selling in person. Either way, it doesn't matter. We want to close the sale now, so we're going to help them through the decision-making process. So they want to think about it, we're going to agree with them, and we're going to help them do that. So we're going to magnify urgency when we do this sale. So urgency is key with this. You know, We want them to, you know, get that fire lit so that they go ahead and make the buying decision go ahead and go forward with it so this presentation or demonstration or illusion whatever you want to call it is to help them understand the urgency of why they need to go ahead and say yes today and then we're gonna close the sale so that's basically the three steps um, of how we're gonna work through it so the first thing that the customer is gonna say to you well, I need to think about it so you're gonna agree with them so the first thing your response is gonna be okay you know I understand you need to think about it I think that's a great decision are you familiar with a high dive at the pool? Now this is gonna do two things. One, um, you're gonna agree with them, so they're gonna kinda of let their guard down, but two, it's gonna kinda of throw them off because it's kind of a strange question when you were just talking about fitness and their goals to just say, yeah, absolutely, think about it. Are you familiar with a high dive? Um, you know, they're gonna be like, uh, yeah. So the answer is usually pretty simple, yes, I, I know what a high dive is. They don't really understand what's going on right here. Um, they just, in their mind, realize that you said, yeah, I can think about it. So they're, you know, their guard's down, they're, you know, kind of, packing their bags ready to go as far as you know what they're thinking is going on right here so yeah absolutely I am okay and so this is where you go into the explanation of the high dive clothes and the idea here is to make this feel long you really want to bring them in with the story so that they can relate with what you're gonna pitch here um, but also you, they're going to be making the decision in their mind as you explain this. So um, you're going to say, okay, well, making this decision is kind of like a high dive. You see, there's a long line of people waiting for that high dive. And you coming to here and, you know, it's going over your fitness plan, that's kind of like waiting in line for that high dive. You know, it takes a while. Everybody's wanting to do it. And you only go, you know, one step at a time. Um, we've gone over how you can reach your goal. We have a plan in place to do it. And so all that's done. You've gone through the line. And now it's finally your turn to climb up the high dive. So what you've done is, you know, you've made the plunge. You know you want to do this. You climbed up the ladder and you're at the top of the ladder. And you're standing at the edge looking down, right? So this is high dive. You know, you're all excited. All you have to do is jump. But something's holding you back. What do you think would happen if instead of jumping, you decide to climb down that ladder and go through all this again? You know, what are the odds of doing that? And what that's going to do, that's going to create, you know, they're just going to, it's going to click for them. They'll be like, you know, I see what you're saying. Like, it's not very likely. If you don't jump then and you climb all the way down and everybody's looking at you, you know, odds are, you know, you're going to leave the pool and you're not going to come back. Like, you know, let's do that. So they're going to say, I see what you're saying. You know, it's not very likely that I'm going to do it again. Boom, that's when you hit him with the clothes. Exactly, let's just do it. So, you know, the whole narrative was in making them feel like they're this person going up the high dive. Um, you know, everybody's rooting for them and they go to the top. It's all there. All they got to do is jump, um, make that decision to say yes. And if they don't, then, you know, it's kind of embarrassing going down and not committing and leaving the pool area. So you help them make that decision and then close quickly on As soon as they understand what you just said, say exactly, let's do it and then don't say a word they're gonna agree with you and then you'll close the sale and you just sign right here you know if you have if it's a manual agreement do they like, perfect go ahead and sign right here if you're selling online say perfect I'm gonna shoot you the link so you can go ahead and get signed up right now 
um, and just make that close. So the idea here is to make a close, go for it, you know, you're, you're describing it and that's the action. So again, it's describing this process, climbing the um, high dive and making that decision. So from there, um, just to kind of recap, we created the illusion of the decision making process. So they said they want to think about it. We agreed. We helped them think about it right there. Um, we created the urgency because we talked about all the work that was put in from them and us to get to the you know solution to solve the problem. And all they have to do is jump and jumping is just saying yes. And then we close the cell. That's essentially it. You know, it's a very, very simple program to run it's a simple close I've used it tons of times and you'd be amazed how often it works you know I've done it where I've done I have a one of my salespeople sell and they bring me over I go into the sale and they're kind of giving me this look like what are you doing and it just works um, you know of course no close works 100% of the time but you want to go in there with your best ammunition to help the person if you believe in your product um, and your product's health and fitness and it's a good product you should close as you know with as much tenacity as you can because if you win you're really going to help this person hope that was helpful one of my favorites the high dive flows if you liked it please give it a thumbs up if you have any comments or suggestions put it in the comment section below and i'll see you guys next time